In this session, we'll begin by retrieving the block part with the commands File, Open, and then making sure the block part is highlighted, we'll click on the Open button. We'll now click on the Hole command. Next, we'll left click on the front face of the block at the approximate location of the hole. Pro-E now displays a preview of the hole. We'll now use the cursor to slide two of the drag handles to the front and top surfaces of the part so that the hole will be dimensioned from these surfaces. And then we'll double click on these dimension values and change them to 10 and 15 units. Next, we'll double click on the diameter dimension and change its value to 10. We'll use the dashboard to change the depth specification to intersect all surfaces so that the hole will extend through all of the part. Now we'll click on the Verify icon, followed by clicking on the check mark icon to complete the construction of the hole.